be held responsible for those words that you spoke, for those for that anger that you thought was so important you had to carry it, for that unforgiveness that you had to carry. Your pride, very important. So as you can see in the title, she is gone, she is dead. That is Ata Jesus, the girl that I made a video about a few days back. I actually made two videos. The first one I said a Sangoma defending the girl and laying their lives before a, a prophet who cast a girl and said that she will not survive if she will not survive it and she will pass from it. Other f uh, church members joined in, they were clapping hands when the prophet was speaking or when the self-proclaimed prophet was speaking. In this particular case, he said that he had prayed and his God was going to avenge him, okay? And the girl is dead. So the curses of this man have um, gone and done what they have done. I want you to think of this picture towards Rita Odechi. Rita Odechi, a, a veteran a celebrity in Nollywood, who joined in to curse this girl because she was like, you know, do you know how offended I was? You were not there. May they do the same thing. And she posted that on Instagram. May they do the same thing to you. Congratulations, madam. Congratulations. Because that those words, you now have to carry that. You see, Risa Odechi said that she was offended. Congratulations. Your offense means nothing. Your offense means nothing. You know, at the cross when Jesus met the biggest of offenses he says forgive them for they know not what they do the biggest of offenses when they're about to take his life he is it forgive them for they know not what to do what they do the the striking thing is this message leave fast prophet because they will lead you astray notice how this prophet he drove these people towards hatred of one young little girl. Now every single one of you will answer for that girl. Don't think you won't. That's what the Bible says. Read 1 Corinthians. It says that what whatsoever we carry, whatsoever we build upon the foundation of Christ, that will follow us to the day and we will answer for every single one of them. He says, for those that are dead, this is revelation when he's talking about the judgment towards the world. Not the judgment of the church, but the judgment of the... He says those things that they have done is recalled forward. For you, it was important that you were offended. Your offense and your curses, <laughs> those words you spoke will follow you and they will haunt you. That's why the Bible says do not get involved in another man's sin. The Bible warns against that. But people continuously go that direction because they don't understand. Love one another. He says, by this will they know that you are his. And so when you cannot display forgiveness, it tells us whose you are. These people followed their prophet towards hatred. That spirit, Daboski, whatever it is, that spirit drove you all towards. And I just want to acknowledge um, I in Genesis made a, a small response. I don't know, maybe he watched the video or he didn't watch the video, but he made a small response of the term, the reference term, so, which is why I think he saw the video, where I said, the part where he says this can be used as a reference. So he cleared that today and he said, well, that's not what he meant. It was not in terms of whether he's a true prophet or a false prophet. So I'm glad he cleared that part so that they don't get the wrong image. It's important you send the right image. This video is sad because I know very well there are people who up until this moment will continue to defend a man who is in error. When a man is in error, you correct him and you let it be. When your pastor is in the wrong, you don't join him in that. That's where you, know, that's where you make a distinction. That's where uh, you're on your own on that one. You have to be very clear because you don't have another one. You see, you will give your account. You won't give both your pastor and your account. And so, yes, you might love your pastor and adore your pastor and look up to him, but know when he is wrong. Because if you lose that part, you lose that consciousness towards right and wrong, you will fall onto the other side of that particular curse and you will be on the receiving end. What do you think happens then? Nothing we can say here. She's gone. But you, on the other hand, 
will be held responsible for those words that you spoke, for those, for that anger that you thought was so important you had to carry it, for that unforgiveness that you had to carry. Your pride, very important. <laughs> so good luck, you can carry that. It's tricky, we're done.